Hello there and welcome to the Indian experience at Mela. In essence, a Mela is a get together, but it's not about the event itself. Mela creates a space for us to meet, exchange ideas, be inspired and be entertained and simply have fun. I'm Karishma Bazde and I'm based in Cape Town and I am one of the newest members of Mela and I'm loving every, every, every second of being a part of this team. I am a huge perfectionist, uh, definitely a type A personality. I like things mostly my way. <laughs> Born and raised Cape Townian, I uh, have always been in love with the arts and being creative. That's why I find myself on this side of the camera. It's a bit weird though, because I'm usually on that side asking the questions, so this feels completely out of uh, my depth. This is Korea Gang, you're pretty much. I'm crazy, I'm fun, I love doing adventurous things. I'm an avid baker, DIY person, I host a show on radio. I do not stop and I cannot stop talking in a... <sighs> Like South Africa, India is a multicultural society and this is reflected in so many ways, including language, custom, costume, cuisine and the art. It all adds up to a rich, colourful and fascinating experience, which is why music, dance, theatre and fine art feature regularly on the Mela lineup. India is mad about the movies and once the Bollywood bug has bitten you, you're a fan for life. That's why it's one of my favourite parts of the show and from new releases to soundtrack songs and celebrity updates, cinema is an essential part of the Indian experience. Indians have an eye for beauty and even in the most humble surroundings, there'll be a dash of colour or a flash of sparkle that catches the eye and lifts the spirit. The sari just oozes classic elegance, but that's just the beginning of Indian style. From sulwars and lehengas for her, to kurtas and shirvanis for him, there are silhouettes and interpretations for every taste, and Mela keeps you on trend. It's impossible to talk about Indian cuisine because it's a feast of so many regional styles based on local ingredients and traditions. Indian cooking has also become an international favourite, inspiring new dishes in the fusion style. And you'll find everything from tried and trusted classics to exciting innovations on the weekly Mela menu. There's nothing new about the fascination that India holds for the world. It's just grown bigger as the globe has shrunk. Bollywood has been an incredible ambassador for all things Eastern, and India is on track. I absolutely love Mela because it is my connection to my grandmother. I mean, every week we watch the Stardust and every week we go watch a Bollywood movie. I love having new experiences and Mela has definitely afforded me the opportunity to have so many new experiences. I get paid to talk and I get to meet the most fascinating people, especially the ordinary people that become extraordinary. And I get to take that with me every day after a film shoot and I just grow. And that's the best thing. Do you know what? It's so nice to not only learn about Indian culture in South Africa, but also to experience it, to see it from different sides of different people, experience it through other people's eyes. It really is just coming to terms with who we are as South African Indians. Apart from all the really serious and poignant interviews that I get to do, we also get to have loads of fun. Highlights of the show must be that sometimes we're forced to do things that we wouldn't necessarily do in normal circumstances. So for me, afraid of heights. But you can't be when you're on a shoot. And you've just sometimes got to take that leap. And it's a leap of faith. Oh my goodness, highlights I have had so many. Um, one that pops to mind immediately is shark cage diving with Neville Pillay. That was so scary and so fun. Well, there was this one time where I got to feed this giant monitor lizard some raw eggs. It was absolutely amazing. I mean, being an animal nut, that was just really one of the highlights for me. I've had some great highlights. Um, I think going to Zanzibar was one of my ultimate favorite moments. We got to go see the turtles. Um, I got to go surfing for the very first time, that was great. Um, also along the line I've learnt a lot of yoga. I haven't practiced it all that much but I've learnt it. I've learnt a couple of dance moves like I think that's a parrot? I wouldn't know but other than that it's really fun. <laughs> I love Mela and everything that it stands for. I love the fact that it's a show that showcases um, a lot of the Eastern world, a lot of um, Indian people that are so inspiring and so talented. What I love so much about the Mela experience is my connection with my culture. 
where it takes me back to, to, to music and songs and food that is somehow in me and in my blood that I've never in my lifetime experienced. So it's amazing that it, it pulls me and ties me so, so closely back to my rich, rich and amazing culture and history. Many South Africans can trace their roots to the East and India has made a significant contribution to South Africa's cultural heritage. Mela is a celebration of the Indian experience in the South African context and everyone is welcome. There's a brand new season of Mela on its way with all the features that the Mela community has come to love while also being packed with exciting fresh content. It's all part of the fascinating, inspiring and entertaining Indian experience and you can be part of it all at Mela. Jetting from Cape Town to Kolkata and beyond, this Eastern themed get together keeps you on trend with the latest in fashion, entertainment, health, wellness and beauty. In fact, everything that puts the style in lifestyle. Coming soon at Mela.